Some people may think that magic is a very questionable area of the performing arts. When you think of the word magician, generally thoughts come to mind of people like Chris Angel or Harry Houdini, but not in this case. Okay, well, Kitchener Waterloo is now. home to a few tricksters of its own, one of which walks the halls of Conestoga College every day. Spoke TV sat down with second year broadcast television what student Joseph Peplinski, or JP that? Magic as he what prefers, to see why he thinks some people are so interested in magic. And I think people want to be fooled, you know? People want to be like amazed by the sleight of hand or a simple entertainer joke. The first book of magic tricks dates back to 1584, but there are more ways than by just reading a book that hopeful magicians can use to learn this form of art in 2014. One spectator and magic enthusiast, Jordan Smith, says one way he observes magic and why it's so interesting to him. Uh, I like watching YouTube videos of magic tricks. I mean, I don't like go to many like actual magic shows or anything. But yeah, I love being fooled. I think that's like the craziest part about it is they do something and you think you know what they're doing and then at the end, it's just not what you expected. Anyone interested in the art of magic in the Kitchener area can even visit Kind of Magic, the local magic and costume shop Uptown Waterloo, where you can find anything from card tricks to spooky props. For Spoke TV, I'm Marion De Palma.